Hey guys, now we're doing a, my, this is my first match I did on Hardline, it's the very first game I ever played. Um, obviously I'm recording this voiceover, um, I did this on Friday so I'm recording this much later, but, um, and I'm gonna do, give my opinion of Battlefield Hardline and stuff. And you know my first thoughts about it and things. So I mean I've played a couple more hours into it now. Um, I've done lots of different things, and this is just my general opinion of how I think they went. And you know, should you get the game? Should you not? Um, obviously, I'm gonna start off here. That gun, the the Scout Elite, is not the best gun to start off with, but you know it ain't the worst. It ain't the worst. It ain't the worst. Um, the scope was very annoying. I got used to it relatively quickly. Um, it's got good fire rate and stuff. I mean, all the guns on the starting one are generally like starting guns you get are always good. Like, good. I find that a lot of them have changed from the beta. Don't expect them to be the same from the beta. Um, because they are really not the same from the beta. I mean, the G18. Um, has been such the like nerf. It, you know, the recoil is so much more, and the, the damage output is so much like less. It's just how oh, I missed that shot. I'll never understand. Well, I got the second one. That's what um, but I mean, it, it gets so useful. The, the ballistics also annoys me on this game because it has the same. A fiction that Battlefield 3 had, by the say that um, it like it, the, the, the bullets take ages to reach their target. Like in a straight line, they have the Battlefield 4 thing of being very very direct. But if you like aim at a target while he's running, they're very much like arrows. They seem to take ages to get to the targets. So you have to aim like quite far in front of them, which is really annoying. Me. I think it'll definitely take some getting used to. Um, another thing that annoyed me, you know, th about the game itself is the fact that, like, they're so close together. I think the maps, even though like, even Conquest Large, I played some Conquest Large, and the maps are so small and they're so tight knit that snipers just, you know, I can understand why the first scope they gave you was six times, because you're not going to need anything bigger than that. I mean, like, it just, it's just so... I mean, even with thir also with even with 33 people, there's 33 people. I, you know, there's like, you either have cluster fucks or you never see anyone. It's it's really disconcerting. There, I thought that was a good shot. I mean, I saved that guy. I, I, that was quite cool. I was quite impressed by that. Um, and stuff like that. That was another thing that really annoyed me. Is this sort of stuff like random? Like, I like them because they're kind of like movie moment sort of thing. But they get very tired of them very quickly, and they're really annoying if you're sniping because they make the whole map shake. And if you're trying to go against the guy with a assault rifle or something, you really don't have you don't have time for that shake. It's just incredibly annoying. But um, it's it's it, you know, the other thing I have a problem with is the people. The people in this game are not the best. I, I immediately started to miss my guys on BF3 and BF4 and stuff. Because no, like, I'm getting like no one playing the objective. I mean, I'm a sniper and I was ca I'm ca capping more bags and bombs and more bombs and stuff than anyone who can do assaults in my team, usually. And the fact of the matter is, they made it so you have to buy revives. Which is incredibly annoying because no one bothers to buy it. So you just get die and then that like gives it someone stupid. Oh, the another thing that really annoys me is those damn other players driving the damn spawn trucks right up your butt. The other spawn the other spawn truck always seems to be tougher than yours. Probably because theirs is not driven by a retard. Yours is always driven right into the guy with the C4 who then proceeds to blow it up. Or puts it right in front of them where every time you spawn, you get out and instantly get killed. That's another thing I hate, is because the enemies can seem to spawn, you capture objectives and the enemies seem to spawn. They seem to spawn all around you, I mean most maps, like that, I didn't even see that guy. 
most maps you'll get shot it from behind just all the time every single deck will be from behind you won't even see that like enemies just spawn all over the place it's just it's just a uh, you know I'm very let down I was hoping for like you know I this is a more powerful game than Battlefield I'm, I'm willing to accept this is a more powerful game than Battlefield 3 and 4 because um, you know obviously it's a much more recent game I'd expect it to be much more powerful um, I'd be there to point it is, and the graphics are beautiful, you know, all the lighting and stuff. I haven't mean, actually, surprisingly, for Battlefield quite early on, I haven't seen that many glitches or anything. Um, yeah, but it's just other other things just Short annoying. Six. It's more it's more of stuff that they should have sort. They shouldn't really have that much problem. It seems like they you know, spend more attention on making the game look good, and feel good, rather than the actual gameplay. Um Yeah, uh, what was it? Um what else was I gonna say? Um Sorry, sorry, I was just thinking. There's um what was it? Um another thing that really, really annoyed me is the fact that these all the armored those cars are armored cars. They just you know don't you just can't find the drive or anything to do anything. See, I did pretty well in this game. This game I didn't do too bad on. Um, but that was my first game. If you like more commentary videos such as this, with my opinion and stuff, then that's fine. Uh, I'm also having issues trying to find platoons on battle log and stuff. Um, but I'll, you know, I'll sort that out and stuff. Because people seem to pay you no respect these days. Even though I have more experience, there's still no one cares. Anyway, moving on. Um, more videos, I'll do a montage soon, and more episodes. See you later. It started out as a routine raid. It has become anything but.